I'm A.C. Grayling, author of The God Argument, the subtitle of which is The Argument Against Religion and For Humanism. And that subtitle is really quite important. This is a book about the quarrel between people who have a religious commitment and those who don't. And what I try to do in the book is to talk about all the different considerations, intellectual, emotional, social, historical, that prompt people to have a religious commitment. And in the debate, and it's been rather a bad-tempered one about religion, these arguments have been rather partially looked at. I try to cover the whole range of them and to give reasons for thinking that all those different kinds of arguments don't work and that there is a, a better and a richer alternative for thinking about how we should live in the world, and that is humanism, which is a very warm, very deep ethical outlook uh, that anybody in the world could share. It's uh, an outlook which premises itself on our best, most generous, most sympathetic understanding of human nature and the human condition. And I argue for it in the book. And um, this attaches itself in a way to something else that I published just recently with Bloomsbury, and that's the good book, A Humanist Bible. The God argument is directed towards people who are interested in the great debate about religion and the alternatives to religion in our contemporary society. And perhaps this is one of the most important debates being had in our time. And what I expect people might be able to take away from this book is a, a much better, more rounded view of what the argument actually is and what the alternative is to a religious view of the world. That's a really, really important thing. And that alternative, humanism, does recommend itself to people if only they will look into it and think about it.